Um, yes, so today we'll be removing the the door mats for this um, CLS 550. Currently, this control isn't working, so I we'll have to remove this whole place to see the electrical connection. If possible, replace the if possible replace the electrical wire. You know, behind the place. So, what do we do about? What how do we go about it first? Um, um, you know, lose this screw. This comes out. We also have this. There are two screws here. One, two. We lose those two screws, and then this comes out, and then one next thing. Uh, you have this. Yeah. It doesn't have a screw, so find a way to carefully unhook it, which I have apparently unhook it one way or the other. And then the next is this bit. Um, this, this bit here, find a way to. Okay, this is how it's going to be a screw here. Lose the screw. Yeah, that's this big thing. Comes out. This also, we pull it out. This also is out. Next, um, this side, carefully slide it out. Take off this side. And this bit, pull it out. So slide it down. Let's see. Side. Yeah, you have two allen keys somewhere around there. Have you seen it? That's it. We have two screws we're going to untie there so that the middle can be free. Yeah. Okay, so what we do next is um gently pull pull this cover out and we have we have the board out. Yeah, so we all have it out here. So, going to. So that's how you remove this. You detach the door mat. You detach the door mat. Let me go. So, yes, um, how do we remove this control? So easy. To remove just this single control for this car, you check behind, and you can see, you know, this particular in the control. There's a screw here. There's a screw here, which um, which I remove. Here is a screw. You untie the screw, then um, you push from the socket here. You push inward. You push inward, it pops out, and then here you have it. That's it. You have it removed.